What's up everyone, TechCloud here and in this video I'm going to compare the Facebook app on Windows Phone 8 and as well as the iPhone 5S. So right now the Facebook app on iOS is the most feature, feature packed app and let's compare this uh, version of the Facebook which is developed by Facebook uh, with the Microsoft developed version of the Windows Phone 8 and let's see what, what are the similarities and uh, what are the differences. Just like uh, many other apps for Windows Phone, the Facebook app also has the live tile and when there is uh, no pending notification, it shows the cover photo that you have uh, put on your profile as you can see here. And if there is any notification, it shows that notification and if that notification involves the text, it will show you the text and if it involves the photo as well, it will show you that photo as well over here. That's very nice touch. This app is designed by Microsoft and it is different from the previous version of the Facebook app which used to exhibit more of a Windows Phone 8 design instead of this app. This, is, this app is more like a standard Facebook app that you see on iOS or Android. Another nice touch about uh, this app is that you can pin certain part of uh, this app to the start menu. For example, I have already pinned the messages to the start page or start menu. And you can also do that uh, for the places as well. And as well as you can do for the pages as well that I have already done. So this is the messenger app that I have already pinned. So if I click on that app, it will directly go to the messages. And similarly, I have uh, pinned the pa pages as well and my tech cloud page. You can see I can access directly through this menu instead of uh, opening the Facebook app and uh, going there and uh, go to the menu and select the tech cloud page. So let's see the both versions of Facebook side by side and let's see what are the similarities and what are the differences. So the scrolling works uh, pretty well on uh, both versions of the Facebook. So if you want to go back quickly to the top of the page, you can click uh, that small arrow on uh, Windows Phone 8 and uh, whereas on iPhone 5s you just uh, double tap the status bar and it will go to the top. Although Microsoft has improved the speed of the app a lot but still it's on the slower side. For example if I click this photo it uh, loads instantly on uh, iOS whereas, whereas uh, it uh, took slightly more time on uh, Windows Phone and most of the features that are available on iOS are also available here but the report photo is not available as you can see here and also the tag option is available on Windows Phone 8 by clicking this uh, tag button I can tag anyone and uh, also the like and the comment button is available which is also available on uh, the iPhone 5s and on uh, both platforms I can uh, see the comments I can leave the comments I can like any photo or the post and also I can see whoever has uh, like a particular photo or a post at times there are actually different uh, way of presenting that post as you can see this is the same post but it is uh, presented in a different way on Windows Phone 8. I'm not saying that uh, one is better over the other but uh, I found uh, a difference so just want to highlight that difference. And also another difference is when I'm uh, going to comment on this post there is no way I can upload a photo whereas on iPhone I can actually upload a photo and I can see the photos in the comments that other people has uh, uploaded whereas on Windows Phone 8 I cannot see those uh, photos that are uploaded by other people. I face uh, one problem regarding some of the photos that uh, you might not be able to understand the text that is written on this uh, photo but you can see the text is not complete on Windows Phone 8 and the edges are not complete. However if you tap on the 
photo then uh, it is fine but uh, somehow it does not fit properly on uh, the previous screen and which is at times uh, does not look that does not uh, look that great and uh, you need to tap uh, on that photo to open that photo properly and read the text on uh, both platforms if i scroll down then the top menu bar becomes uh, disappear in order to give way to more contents on the screen however if i scroll uh, upwards then or backwards then the menu bar appears again and i can actually click on this button to write the status on uh, both devices however there are little bit difference in the functionality that there is actually no mood button or the feeling button you can say on the windows phone 8 however it is available on uh, the ios version everything else works the same and there is uh, no issue over here if i want to post a photo then i can go back to that uh, menu bar and click that photo button and it actually takes slightly longer for the Nokia Lumia 1520 to load that uh, photos or album because probably the size of the photos is slightly bigger on Lumia as compared to iPhone or probably the app is sl slightly slow anyways it does exhibit that uh, behavior on uh, Windows Phone or the Lumia 1520 you can say other than that uh, most of the functionality is there you can uh, select multiple photos and you can take uh, photos at this at uh, this particular moment as well however there are some editing option available on uh, ios if you tap the photo instead of uh, selecting that photo that's uh, only available on uh, ios version it is not available on the windows phone version you can actually check in using both uh, phones if you click the check-in button you can see that uh, both phones does give the check-in option and it works pretty well on both of them however you can see the the marker on the ios version that it actually tells me my current location as well where i'm standing at the moment you can see that uh, small dot the blue dot on the top other than that it works uh, pretty similarly on both of them the additional option on windows phone 8 is that uh, you can actually see on the map those particular uh, things that are listed down below that where actually they are located on the map that's nice touch so let's look at the other menu options you have uh, friends request as you can see on uh, both of the phones but on uh, iPhone actually there is some additional uh, thing which is actually the people you might know list that is available there and also if you press the plus button there are actually additional options available you can search people you can uh, actually browse your uh, contact list and uh, it will uh, scan your contact list and uh, see whether these people are available on Facebook or not so these are some of the additional things available However, the search function is also available on uh, Windows Phone 8 where you have to press the menu and you can go to the search over here. If you click the messaging, then you can uh, access your messages. You can write uh, new messages. You can reply to them to different people. And actually, you can click on uh, people on uh, iPhone to see what are the people that are actually contacting you lately and there is a switch button on windows phone if you press that switch button you have two options inbox and other iphone does not have this functionality and this is actually nice to see because most most of the mobile phones does not show the messages in the others folder but windows phone does has the ability to show the others folder as well these messages are actually from the people who are not currently in your uh, contact list and there are some additional settings available for the messenger on uh, iphone 5s actually the messenger app is a different app on uh, ios and i have installed that app and if i click the messaging it actually switches to that app 
which has more functionality slightly more functionality than windows phone 8 but nothing that uh, you are going to miss on windows phone if you click the notifications tab it will show you exactly the same information on uh, both of the phones and it works uh, pretty, pretty much uh, in the same way on uh, both phones next up is the menu button it is uh, located in the bottom right corner on iphone whereas it is located on top left corner on uh, windows phone and most of the menu items are same as you can uh, see here and uh, the photos are actually listed at the bottom in the apps if you click the photos on the both it will uh, show you the photos and the albums in uh, one group on uh, windows phone 8 whereas uh, it shows different apps uh, on uh, iphone 5s for the timeline photos and as well as the album that shows two tabs instead of one whereas on windows phone 8 it's uh, available in a single tab the only difference that i see here is that there is no photo sync option on uh, windows phone it is available on ios and the photo sync option is basically whatever photos that you take it will automatically sync with your uh, facebook uh, account and uh, you can select uh, later on the pictures that you want to post on your profile the sync uh, does not automatically means that it will be available publicly and uh, also you can uh, add uh, more albums using uh, both phones so the functionality is pretty similar in that regard so you can uh, access the uh, pages you can access different groups that you have liked and uh, most of the these most of these settings are pretty similar here and the only difference that i see beside uh, other differences that i've mentioned is the list of apps is uh, slightly less on windows phone there is only photos and notes whereas there is game and find people available on iphone 5s as well if you click the games uh, it will take you to the list of the games that are available on uh, facebook as you can see here and if you click on the find people it will actually once again take you to the same place which you have uh, seen uh, under the friends request button to me the only major difference here in this menu is the settings options the settings are pretty limited on um, windows phone 8 and it will take you and rather it will redirect you to the mobile website whereas on iphone 5s it will give you the privacy settings uh, within that app so that's the only major difference uh, that i find here other differences are minor in this menu other additional things are like the help center and as well as the feedback things like that which uh, does not matter much to the regular user on the pages actually you cannot uh, post the photos you can only post uh, messages on uh, windows phone whereas on ios you can actually post uh, photos on page on the facebook pages as well So guys, uh, this is the comprehensive comparison of the Facebook app between the Windows Phone 8 platform and the iOS platform. Please note that uh, this comparison is for the current situation only and uh, both apps will keep on updating and the newer features will be available on both platforms. So this uh, comparison might change over time, but this is just to give you the current situation at the moment. So I hope uh, that you have uh, liked the video and if you have liked it then uh, please press the thumbs up button at the bottom of this video and uh, make sure you subscribe to the channel for more videos like that. Take care and I'll see you later in some other video. Bye.